What's going on? Ryan here, and today I'm going to show you how to build three chatbots powered by ChatGPTBuilder.io. Let's get into it. All right, step one, head on over to ChatGPTBuilder.io. So for the first chatbot, we're going to make a chatbot for one of my favorite barbecue restaurants, Jim and Nick's. Click on this welcome block on the left-hand side here. I've already got an action set up for calling OpenAI's API. And we want a text completion, but we do have the option for an image. And what we're going to do here is say, here is our business name, which is Jim and Nick's. And here is our prompt. You're a helpful agent for Jim and Nick's and ask how we can help. Okay, we do want to remember the conversation maybe. And we're going to save the output to a custom field called Welcome GPT Output. You could have named this anything you wanted. This is the custom field. So we tell OpenAI what we want to happen. It says, sure, here's the result. Where do you want me to put it? And they're putting it where we tell it to save. And in this case, it's this custom field, Welcome GPT Output. And then what we're gonna do is head on over to the settings section. Click on integrations, click Open AI, and hit edit. This is where your prompt will be. So this is the prompt that I'm using in this case. Jim and Nick's restaurant, your helpful assistant, your jobs to assist customers. I've got their menu information here. So it's um, you know menu item, price, menu item, price, size. So smaller or larger, the price is different. It also is showing, is it gluten-free or not? So if we see a yes somewhere here, fresh fruit, gluten-free is what they're saying here, right? So this information just came straight from their website. All right, so that's what we got. So just so you see me do it, I'm gonna just copy the whole thing. We're gonna paste it right here. So boom. Pasted right there we'll just hit continue so now we're all set we're ready to test this bad boy and we're going to go to tools to test this and we're going to scroll down to bot simulator so let's click on web chat we're going to paste in their website link here we'll click more options and we'll choose that welcome message all right for the brand color let's choose something like more like a reddish Something like that, and hit OK. So now we're ready, get the link. So here is their website, right? And what we'll do is we'll paste our link right next to it. Boom, all right, perfect. So we've got our prompt here. And so let, let's, let's, let's test it out. So the barbecue sandwich is 949. So let's say, let's ask that question. So it's, it's going to welcome us first. Hello and welcome to Jim and Nick's. We're so glad you're here. How can we assist you today? And I'm going to say how much is the... I'm going to copy it. We're looking for 949. How much is the barbecue pork sandwich? Boom. 949. What do you have gluten-free options so they give us some gluten-free options so we have several options on the menu baked beans potato salad coleslaw so let's check if we can see that baked beans boom potato salad boom Col look at that guys all of them the next one's going to be beachside bluffton auto tire body shop place open ai Edit and delete and paste. All right, so we just changed the business information here and we updated the business information here. We didn't change anything else. We'll hit continue and publish that. And we're going to go to Bot Simulator and we'll paste that link there. Again, we'll choose Web Chat. We'll choose Chat GPT Builder. Welcome. Let's try to match that color. Hit OK. Get the link. And let's open 
a new incognito window so our cookies don't interfere and boom so there's the the web chat with the correct color we just chose which matches their little border there so it looks nice and let's click the web chat we should get our message here it says bam welcome to beachside tire auto bluffton llc we're delighted to have you do you need help with tire services auto repairs or any other needs our team of experts is here to provide you with the best services so i'm going to say do you work on chevy silver rados do you work on chevys yes we do great they're master technicians and look at this please feel free to give us a call there's the number or stop by there's the address um what was your address again make sure we just get that address look at that guys 20 burnt church road right there so then let's check one more and this one's probably the the coolest let's find it i'm calling it the pocket preacher <laughs> or uh the the church bible bot in this case okay let's go ahead and copy our prompt again this one's actually uh, quite a bit shorter open ai edit delete all that stuff paste in our new prompt let's go back into flows and introduce ourselves as bible bot click here and bible bot you're a helpful agent for bible bot your goal is to provide a warm and warm welcome and ask how BibleBot can assist you or pray for you today. And we'll go back into Bot Simulator. And let's, we need to give it a link here. Bible.com Let's see. So here's Bible.com. We'll copy the URL. Let's paste it in. Let's get the link and paste it. So we've got their site here and we should have our version here. Let's see if we can simulate it perfectly, perfectly done. All right, so let's click the chat bot now and it should tell us, welcome, we're the Bible bot. So, hello, welcome to BibleBot. It's great to have you here. How can I assist you? Would you like me to pray for you, or is there anything specific you'd like to discuss or to learn? I need help to stay on the right path and to focus on um, the things God wants me to focus on on guys this is incredible of course i'm here to help one verse that may be helpful for you is proverbs 3 verses 5 through 6 that says trust in the lord with all of your heart and lean not on your own understanding in all your ways submit to him and he will make your paths straight this verse reminds us to trust in god and to submit to his will even when we don't understand the path he has for us this is incredible. So let, let's try one more. Let's say, um, okay, I have another issue I want to get help with. Let's think of what we want to say. Um, sure, I'm here to help. What's on your mind? I'm going to say, tell me how I can be the best father to my little baby girl let's see what we get straight from the b-i-b-l-e tell me how to be the best father to my little baby girl okay boom look at that being a good father is a wonderful goal i'm glad that you're seeking guidance on how to be the best father <clears throat> Being a good father is a wonderful goal, and I'm glad you're seeking guidance on how to be the best father you can be. Here are a few steps.
That is not what I wanted. All right, let's hit him with another one here. So how can we help? How can I be the best father to my baby girl? And I want to be the best dad. All right, so let's ask it one more question here. I'm going to say, um, how can I be the best dad and best husband that I can be, right? How can I be the best dad and best husband that I can be from the Bible? Let's see what we're going to get. These answers have been incredible. So it's saying being the best dad requires a lot of effort. Da, 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 da. Communicate. Pray together. I love that one. Being the best dad and husband is only like people with God's help. You can be loving and supportive. This is so awesome, guys. So that is it. Three different bots, totally different, three different purposes. And it's basically if you can copy and paste a prompt. If you can copy and paste a prompt, you can build a bot. Thanks for watching. If you've got any questions, leave them down below. Peace.